Hi everyone, my name's Jordan and welcome back to my channel. Are you giggling? <laughs> Today I have a very special guest, my husband. This is Chris and he's gonna be helping me make a video today. So I'm stealing this video idea from Jess Owens. Uh, she has posted a few videos of her and her husband where she blindfolds herself and her husband chooses like five books that he then has to explain the cover and she has to try to guess it. So I was like, what the hell, this will be fun. Chris is not a reader. He doesn't have any like inside scoop into the books he's choosing. He is going to just blindly pick. So do we want to have any stakes involved? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> um, hmm. If I get four out of five right, I get to go spend $50 at Barnes & Noble. Okay. But if I don't, what do you get? If I get, I, I don't know, I get to spend $50 wherever I want. All right, so I have this as a blindfold, this headband, because it'll squish my eyes closed. Also, I'm not wearing makeup because I'm blindfolded, so you're welcome, everyone. All right, so you can choose your five books that I feel like. Can you see out of that? No, I, I, it's literally pushing on my eyeballs. Um, so- I just choose? Yeah, pick five random books. I'm gonna plug my ears. Do I have to like stand up? Yeah, stand up and get them. But they're gonna see my butt. They'll see your butt. Um, but I'm gonna plug my ears so I can't hear where you're pulling books from because I know my bookshelves. Oh God, there's hair in my eye. Oh, ow! You have five minutes? Yeah. Okay. okay. So pull it up and hold it in front of the camera so they can all see what the book is. Okay. And then go ahead and describe it. It's yellow. Okay. Um, there's two towels on the page. Two towels? Yep, two Beach towels. Read. Oh, okay. By Emily Henry. That was quick. <laughs> um, there's a person in a red robe. In a Scythe. Okay. <laughs> you picked the easiest ones. <laughs> okay. You held, you held it up? I can't see. It's black. Um, and there's horses on the front page. And some person where, um, with a crown and long flowing hair. And the horses on the front page have flowy hair. What? Yep. <laughs> um, the text is yellow and red. And that is it that I can describe for you. Yellow and red text. Yellow and red text. Black book. Black book. Horses. Horses. A woman, you said, with flowy hair? Um, I would. I, I can't just assume, but yes, it seems like a woman with long hair and a crown. On horses. It's horses. spooky, spooky text. Spooky text? What? <laughs> Um, I don't have many spooky books, I feel like. Is it a paperback or a hardback? Um, I assume this is a paperback. Is it soft or hard? Yeah, it's soft. <laughs> um, it's crusty. Is it small like it this? It is a, it is an uh, airplane book. I don't know what that means. It seems like a book that people read on the airplane. Oh, because it's little? It's small. But it, but also thick. Chunky. Woman with flowing hair. It's black with spooky text. When do you just give up? Is it a Raymond Feist book? Yes. Is it? It's called like. Oh my gosh. I haven't read this. I haven't read any of these. It's called like. Why do you have this on your shelf? I got it for like two dollars. It's called like Queen of the Shadow something. I mean, you're close. I'm not gonna get any closer than that, I think. What is Shadow it? of a Dark Queen. Oh, I'm so close. Okay, so I'm two for three. Okay, I really screwed this this one up. Okay. It's a green background, a woman in a red dress. Uh, Mexican Gothic. Okay. Okay, last book. You really picked some iconic <laughs> covers. 
<laughs> you did not try to make this hard for me. You want me to spend fifty dollars? Um, I, I I guess so. Um, it's a snowy background with antlers and a man with an axe in the cape and a cape. It, oh, more colors. It's white and brownish. Is it a library book? Nope. This is a book that you own. Is it hardcover? It is a hardcover. Well, it's a it's a hardback book. Okay. The dog wants to sniff. So. Is the dog here? Yeah. Hi, Buck. Um, I know it's a Fitz book. I just... Which one? Snowy cover. Is it... Fool's Assassin? Okay. Yep. I got it? Yep. So, so I'm four for five. Yep. That went much faster than I thought it would. Do we want to do five more since I got them so fast? I mean, I guess. Okay. I hope this mic is picking up. It's so far away. It's black cover. Okay. Uh, um, an animal skull with berries in one eye and red war paint. Ginormous book. Something I would never put in my hands. Um. White text. Explain it again. Black cover. Mm -hmm. Animal. What kind skull, of animal? Um, a deer with uh, oh, okay. war paint and uh, what seems to be berries in its eye. Is it... Oh, those have human skulls. A deer skull with berry eyes, you say? Hmm. Black cover, white text. Anything else you can tell me? Is there like a background? Um, it looks like there is a um, fur coat of some sort hanging on a tree. Or what? something. What the hell kind of book is this? Is it one you've heard me talk about? Sure. Actually? Yep. So I should know because I don't talk to you about many books. It's quite big. Hardcover? No, paperback. Oh. Black book, white text. I'm gonna, am I going to feel stupid if I don't get this? I think so. Great. Okay. Um... I can't think of it. What is it? The Wall of the of Storms. Oh, that's a new book. Well, next book. <sighs> um, it has a light blue background. Um, and this weird ancient stone-like uh, thing with two swords and serpents around it. Very ancient looking. Like, by ancient, do you mean crumbling? No. Just looks like stone. Or marble. And it's a blue book? Yes. Softback? It's hard. Sharp text. Sharp text, you say? <laughs> what does that mean? I don't know. It's got sharp edges on the ends of the words. It oh. Looks Two serpent looking things wrapping around two swords that are crossed. Yo. You made it harder round two. Do you give up? Not yet. Hold on. There's nothing else. Um It looks like a leaf on the background, but it's blue. Is it chunky? I mean it's just a normal book. Not chunky then. Or not more chunky than per the usual. Um, I want to get it. I don't know. The Bone Shard Emperor. Death up to me. There's so much more on that cover than just what you said. I don't think so. Um, next book. The very vibrant. Um, lots of people. Um, there's a train, a witch, a chubby black man. Uh, another uh, strong looking man in uh, armor and then a train conductor in the top left corner. 
top right corner. Traits? <laughs> yep. Again, stone text. Traits? I don't have any terrain books. Soft cover? Is graphic novels count? Oh, oh, it's a graphic novel. Oh, okay. It's a uh, Murder on Rockport Limited. Okay. Okay. Next. Um, weird text. Um, two people of color in the background, I guess with rocks. Um, and it's yellow and orange with white text also. A uh, normal sized paperback. You said two people. Oh, of color. I said oh, it should be three people of color. I lied. With rocks. Yes. Does it look like modern? It looks like a um, very randomly put together title or a uh, front cover page. Clip art. Clip art. What book did you get? I don't know, and I hope the per if you ever watch this video, you don't take offense. Wait, it's somebody we know? No. I don't know. Looks like it could be a 90s soap opera. My best friend's exorcism? What? No. Do you give up? No. 90s soap opera. Like, I don't know. This is very just plain. Plain book with three people with rocks. Yellow and orange words and then also white text. And what color is the overall book? General color? Black. With a yellow stripe down the back. Yo, you picked you picked some some ringers for this last round. You give up? It's paperback? Yeah. Am I gonna feel dumb with my own this one? I don't think so. Hold on, give me one second more. I'm trying to think of my more obscure shelves. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. Goliath. Oh! Okay. <gasps> this last one should be quite easy. Um, it looks like just... Um, uh, this is tough. A sword through an eye in the front cover with what looks like planets and rings. Black book gold um, text with also giant white text in the center. Skull with a sword I guess I would say this would be a solar system. You would feel really stupid not knowing this book. And there's a skull with a sword. No, I said an eye with the, with the sword going through it. Oh, the Atlas Six. Yep. <laughs> I thought you said a skull. I was like, planets and skulls. Is that all of them? Yeah, that's it. She has awakened. How many did I get right? I don't know. I think you missed three out of the five. Well, we did ten. So, do the math. You got six of ten. Six of ten. That's not very good. <laughs> um, wonderful. Well, that was fun. Thank you for helping me with this video. Um, it was... <laughs> I thought it was going to be a lot harder, and that first round I got real confident, and then you pulled out some of the uh, dingers for that last round. Uh, I knew next to nothing in that last round. Um, I'm going to chalk it up to your poor explanation skills. <laughs> I don't think that's true. <laughs> um, anyway, thank you guys for watching husband reveal. If you liked this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know down below if there are any other fun videos that I can make Chris participate in as a non-reader. If you really like my channel, please hit the notification bell to be notified every time I post new videos. Thank you guys for watching. As always, your support means the world to me, and until next time, thank you guys.